I'm wondering if you changed your mind about running for nothing's, re-election. Nothing's changed. Nothing's changed in the sense that you said there's that no. I, except that I'm late to go. For but there's no. Senate. There's no way you'll be on the ballot. Nothing's changed from the last time I've spoken to you about this. Look, I have a real good friend I've known for a long time who's running for the Senate race. He, I didn't run. I said I wasn't gonna. He got into the race. He's a, he's a lieutenant governor of Florida. I think he's a strong Carlos Lopez Cantari. He's a strong candidate. He's in the race. I'm not gonna. I'm, you know, I'm not. I think he's put in time and energy to it, and he deserves the chance to see where he can take it. If if you didn't have a friend running, might you reconsider? Maybe. Your announcement today, what led to this decision? I honestly think that uh, no matter what happens in this election, no matter who's elected president, we're going to need a Senate that fulfills its constitutional duty to act as a check and balance on the excesses of the presidency. And so I believe I'm the only one running that uh, will provide that. And, and I feel compelled to not walk away from that opportunity. Friend, the lieutenant governor was running for the Senate seat. Mm -hmm. What were the conversations like? Well, I was very supportive of him. Uh, he came to me about 10 days ago and asked me to run to reconsider my decision. And when he did so, I promised him that I would.